All right, guys, this is the FIFA 21 ratings. You guys have probably saw this already. I have not seen this FIFA 21 ratings, so we're just going to check it out right now. We're at the EA.com games. Top players in FIFA 21. Okay, like I said, I have not seen these stats. We're going to see and we're going to react to these stats, boys. We're going to start with Messi. Now, quick question. Quick question. Should Messi be the highest rated player on FIFA 21? No, he should not be the highest rating player of FIFA 21. Should Cristiano Ronaldo be the highest rating player of, of FIFA 21? No, he should not be. Should Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo be the same rating? Yes. Should they be higher than anybody else? Yes. So I don't know why the fuck Cristiano Ronaldo has a 92. Messi has a 93 overall. But wow, look at that pace. Messi, 85 pace, 92 shooting, 91 passing, 95 dribbling, 38 defense, 65 physical. All right, I understand the pace. Yes, that's an understandable pace. I will actually even lower that a little more just because he does seem a little bit slow. I'll probably give him like an 83, maybe 82. With the shooting, it's perfect shooting. I'll actually give him more passing, to be honest. I, I feel like 91 is very low. Passing should be higher than shooting, to be honest, for Messi. Passing should be like a 93, 92, maybe. And then we're going to go with Cristiano Ronaldo, second highest play player in FIFA. We're gonna go 89 pace. What a fucking disrespect to the GOAT, Cristiano Ronaldo. He should have 90 pace. I don't know why they gave him 89. FIFA again fucking people over with these stats. 89 dribbling. I do not understand this man. This guy dribbles the ball like crazy. Maybe not like Messi, but this guy knows how to stop the ball, how to control the ball, and how to pass the ball. Like That's disrespectful. 89 uh, dribbling. 93 shooting. I feel like, look, if Messi's gonna have 95 dribbling, and this is best, best attribute, I feel like Cristiano Ronaldo's best attribute is, not, is shooting. Because he can shoot with both legs. And for FIFA to give him 93 and Messi 95 dribbling, I feel like that's a little bit disrespectful. Cristiano Ronaldo should definitely have a 95 shooting if Messi has a 95 dribbling. And then we got 81 passing. Again, really just FIFA hating on Cristiano Ronaldo, man. It should be higher. I mean, the passes he does. Come on. And 70 cent physical, bro. Cristiano Ronaldo's one of the strongest players in the world. That's so disrespectful. 77 physical. Then we're going to go with... uh. Actually, we're going to skip Lewandowski just because I don't, I don't really like him then we're gonna go with Neymar right here 91 pace 85 shooting 86 passing 94 dribbling look I understand yes yes one less than Messi right 95 dribbling Messi Neymar 94 dribbling I understand that I accept that that's okay 91 pace he's really fast yeah I understand that is Neymar faster than Cristiano Ronaldo actually I actually think CR7 is faster than Neymar. If you put them in the race, I feel like Cristiano Ronaldo is going to beat Neymar. So I don't know why Neymar got a 91 pace and Cristiano Ronaldo got an 89 pace. 85 shooting from Neymar, yes, that's acceptable. He, his shooting is okay. And 86 passing. Look, I feel like Neymar should have 89, 88 passing, bro. His passing is so underrated, guys. The fifth highest player is De Bruyne. Oh, Cam. I play like De Bruyne in pro clubs. We got a 76 pace, 86 shooting. I feel like I feel like the Bruin shooting should be higher. The Bruin shooting is so underrated, man. FIFA is sleeping on the Bruin shooting. I should I feel like it should be an 88, 87, maybe. 93 passing from De Bruin. FIFA, are you fucking telling me right now that De Bruin can pass the ball better than Messi? Comment down below on this YouTube video, guys. Is De Bruin my answer? No. Easily. Easily. No. He does not bro. 93 passing for De Bruin? No. Not better than Messi, bro. Come on, bro. I'm telling you, De, De Bruyne can, does not have better vision, does not pass the ball better than Messi. So FIFA fucked it over there. 88 dribbling from De Bruyne. All right, that's respectable. I feel, yeah, that's good. That's good. A 64 defense. I feel like De Bruyne is a very physical person. He knows how to defend a little more. I feel like a, a 68 would have been good for him. And then a 78 physical. I feel like this guy is fucking huge, man. I feel like he's strong, fast. I feel like it should have been an 80. To be honest for the brewing but again fifa's fucking people over all right then we got van dyke here 76 pace 70 dribbling all right look look i feel like van dyke should have like a 79 pace he deserves like maybe like a 80 pace 79 pace his speed is very underrated that's okay okay yeah i feel like yeah that's a good dribbling stat 71 passing i feel like this guy has like a 74 passing he's his passing is underrated again man then we got 91 defense and 86 physical 91 defense it, it should have been it should have been 92 bro it should have been 92 
this guy almost wins the Ballon d'Oro because of his defense, bro. Nobody crossed him. And then 86 physical, I like, again, I feel like his physical should be a lot more. Everybody says how strong and fast this guy is. So overall 90, yeah, well-deserved. I feel like it should have been 91, but that's okay. Then we got Mane 90 overall. Ooh. All right, we got Mane 94 pace. Yes, this guy is fucking fast as hell. All right, we got 85 shooting for Mane, 80 passing, 90 dribbling, 76 physical. All right, so I haven't seen Mane play a lot, but... I guess these are his stats. I don't watch Liverpool a lot play, so I wouldn't know about Mane. I know this guy's fast as fuck. His dribbling is insane too. Salah and Mane, 90 overalls, bro. Liverpool got some high rated ass players, man. Allison with a 90 overall, damn. This is the card that I don't think should be fucking here, guys. In top players in FIFA 21, Ben Bappe shouldn't be here. Let me explain. He should be here, but his rating shouldn't be 90, bro. Ben Bappe is not a 90. Ben Bappe is not a 90. Let me repeat that. Ben Bappe is the fastest, one of the fastest players in the world. 96 pace. I agree. 91 dribbling? No, I do not agree about this. I don't know. I mean, 91 dribbling? I don't know. Let's go. Does Ben Bappe have better control than Cristiano Ronaldo? I don't think so. 86 shooting? I think the shooting is way too high for this kid, man. Do you guys want me to remind you what happened in the finals? All right. Is that an 86 shooting? Is that an 86 shooting? Someone tell me if that's an 86 shooting. Someone tell me if that's an 86 shooting. That's a 79. That's a 79 shooting. Beba Pe shouldn't have 86 shooting. 89 rating, Aguero. Dios loco, pero that's a little high, man, Aguero. Did he really have a great season? What was Aguero's stats this, this year? Then we got Sergio Ramos. Is Sergio Ramos the last, the last one? 70, 71 pace, bro. I'll give him a little higher. I feel like he's he's fast. 70 shooting. I feel like his shooting is too high. Oh, he does take free kicks, though. Pretty good free kicks. Penalties always score them. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, okay. I'll give him 70. I'll probably put like 72, 73, maybe a little higher. 74 dribbling. Yeah, I feel like his dribbling is a lot better than Van Dyke's, though. How much does Van Dyke have? How many? How much dribbling? 72 and Sergio Ramos. 74. I feel like it should be a 75. The disrespect. The disrespect, bro, of EA giving Sergio Ramos an 89 and Van Dijk a 90, bro. I, th I feel like they both should be 90s, but whatever. 88 defense, 85 physical, and 76 passing. All right, I'll agree with that. Benzema, one of the best seasons that in his career he had with Real Madrid this year because Cristiano Ronaldo left, obviously, so he had a takeover, you know, put the team on his back. When Real Madrid was shit, he was there for them, so shout out to Benzema. Looking all serious, bro. Yo, what's up with these two guys right here? Why are these two guys so fucking serious? <laughs> all right, we got Courtois right here. Bro, we got... Why do we have so many Real Madrid players? Real Madrid played like shit this season. They shouldn't be that high, to be honest. Now I saw Casemiro right there, bro. Okay, and we got Kroos right here, bro. All right, Courtois we got... Okay, blah, 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 blah. All right, should Neuer, should Neuer and Courtois have the same overall, guys? That's the question. Because Courtois had a shit season at the beginning of the season and then started getting better. I feel like Courtois should have... Look, this is the power of Real Madrid telling FIFA to, to make our players look good in FIFA. So people can think they're good. Courtois should have like an 87, 88. Why is Navas not here and Courtois is here? Are you telling me... Oh, bro, Navas went to the final with incredible saves. You're telling me Courtois had a better season than Navas? Impossible. Impossible. So I feel like Courtois, that's bullshit. Navas should be here. Let's rate Navas. Navas, 84 diving, 89 handling, 74 kicking, 88 reflex, 46 speed, 85 position. All right. Then now we're going to go with Casemiro. Casemiro should not be an 89, boys. Casemiro should not have an 89. Real Madrid, stop. Stop. Stop whatever you're doing, how much, I don't know, I don't care how much money you're fucking sending EA, you gotta stop with this, this is a fucking joke, that's too high for him, 65 pace, 70, 73 dribbling, 73 shooting, I feel like his shooting should be a little higher, like around 75 maybe, 76 passing, I feel like his passing should be less, I feel like his passing is not that good, I think it should be like a 72, and then we got 91 physical, Yes, he's a very strong guy in 86 defense. Then we got Hando Novic. I don't know who that goalie is. I know he plays in Inter Milan. I just don't see him a lot, to be honest. And then we got Kroos right here. This is the only player I actually agree should be here. Obviously, Sergio Ramos should be there. And uh, Benzema. But I don't know about Casimiro and Courtois. They shouldn't be here. Uh, Kroos should be here with the 54 pace, 81 dribbling, 81 shooting. I feel like his shooting is very underrated. He shoots the ball so beautiful, man. I remember the Germany, the World Cup, bro. The free kick, man, he did. It's sexy, man. Germany to earn a victory here. Kroos will go for it and score! 
an inspirational moment from Tony Kroos. 91 passing, 89. I think his passing should be higher, bro. Maybe a, eight, a 92, probably. 69 physical, 71 defense. All right, all right. Okay, I agree with those stats. Those are not bad. All right, guys. Those were the top players in FIFA 21, guys. Th this is the only fucking card that matters, to be honest. No other fucking FIFA card matters, guys. I'm about to show you the, 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 the card that matters the most. This is the only card that matters. All right, boys, someone gave me a zero cam. What a disrespect, bro. I mean, at least I look good in the picture, you feel me? Zero overall, bro. Zero penalties. Zero World Cups. 99, uh, uh, 99. How am I, how are you going to give me 99 passing, but I'm a zero overall? 99 Pep Guardiola. 99 defense. 10 physical. Hey, come on. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Hey, if I can. Why the hell are you putting Barcelona next to my fucking player, bro? I'm from Hala Madrid, papa. Or Madrid or Juventus. All right, 85 cam. That's decent. Feel me, Isaac. 77, 77 pace. All right. I I'm a lot faster than that, but whatever. Come on, bro. You cannot give me that low on shooting, bro. Have you seen my shots from outside the box, bro? 84 dribbling, bro. Come on. I'm a cam, bro. Come on, bro. Stop, stop, stop. All right, boys. See that? See that's this what I'm talking about right here, baby. It's 97 overall. Let's go, boys. 76. Hey, yo, what's up with people giving me such a low pace, bro? Like I'm a 92 pace, 78 pace, 85 shooting, 95 passing. That's what I'm talking about. 90 dribbling, yes, sir. Yo, my defense is so fucking underrated, bro. My defense is so fucking underrated, but hey, I'll take it, bro. I'll take it. 70 physical, like I said. Alama. Adama, where are you, Adama? What you talking about 70? What you talking about 70? What you talking about 70? Stop playing with the kid, bro. Stop playing with the kid. Stop playing with the kid, bro. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Come on now! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Come on now! Come on now! How the fuck you gonna put that picture and give me a 61 overall, bro? A bronze. What the fuck is this, bro? Daddy Isaac the GOAT. All right, 78 uh, striker. All right, that's the, okay. That's good. All right, all right. All right, you could at least get a better picture. You feel me? Like, that was when I shaved my head. But now I look good, you know? Oh, my God. <laughs> Yo, are you kidding me, bro? Come on, bro. <laughs> he put me as Arsenal. 65. Yo, what's up with these low overalls, bro? You guys are really disrespectful, bro. With the 65. Thank you guys for watching, man. This was me reacting to the new FIFA cards. Uh, really excited to start this game, guys. Uh, it starts October October 7th, guys. Or, or, or October 6th, the uh, FIFA 21 season. Hope you guys had a great time on the stream. And if you're watching me on YouTube, thank you guys for watching this video. Peace out. See you guys in the next video. See you guys on the next stream, man. Isaac Galera out, guys. Always remember, be grateful for the little things. Yeah,